the storms this week. Luckily, Paul, it doesn't look as bad as we saw last week in terms of the ingredients coming together. But look, it is March. We know that kind of kicks off the thunderstorm season, right? So let's uh, watch what happens with this front come in. The energy up to the north. We see this front track all the way to the east. You know, in the northeast, yes, the front goes off the coast, but look what happens to our front deck back down into the Tennessee Valley. It lingers, and you know what? It ends up sort of uh, resurging across the south with some more moisture coming in throughout the midweek. So we've got a lot to look at for the week ahead. It's going to be a rainy Tuesday for you up to the Ohio Valley, parts of the northeast. That's that portion of the front that will make progress. But then go back here into the plains. Remember, we are going to see this frontier linger actually throughout the week. It's there on Tuesday in Wednesday, we're watching the Tennessee Valley. The chance for thunderstorms, the chance for more rain coming in on very saturated areas. We've been talking a lot about just how wet the soil moisture is. In fact, that's a topic we'll delve a little more into this morning. What can you do about your yard? It is so wet. Now, here in Shreveport, Louisiana, the rain comes in on Monday. Then we get a couple of days break. Look how warm it gets. Temperatures heading up to the 80s, 81 degrees on, on Tuesday. If you like that, there's more of it coming on Wednesday, 82 degrees. But with that warm air, you always worry about the increased moisture the increased humidity uh, and the increased risk of thunderstorms after that. So we'll, we'll keep watch on Shreveport. Indianapolis, we've got rain coming in for us Tuesday into Wednesday, and you can see our temperatures hanging off in the 50s as well. It's going to be a mild week for everyone, even Albany. I mean, there's no chance of snow in the forecast. Our temperatures here, 60 degrees on Tuesday with this front coming through. Even Tuesday night when it cools down, we're going down to 39 degrees, and it's showers that will wrap up for you into Tuesday night when we get a break before the next system comes in here to the Northeast here. But you know how March can go. We can have a little bit of everything and anything, Paul, in the month.